Behind the mighty shoes. There's an old church in Moshi, exactly one. I believe it was built around 1920. There was an ancient Tibetan temple on the site before the church was built. They demolished the temple, the Tibetan temple, and built the church right on its foundations. Do they still have services here? Do they still use it? They do use it in case you didn't hear Dantop. Instead of a church, it's referred to as the Christmas temple because they have these Christmas trees perpetually blinking. The decorations are certainly interesting in this church. We're much lower in Moshi, only about 6,000 feet, 2,000 2, something meters, and it's much warmer down here. They can grow almost anything. We're not done. Mr. Wang is taking us up another one of Moshi's alleys. A Buddhist temple in Chinese style. Hello, Nihao. Yeah. It's 50 per night. Included TV, carpeting, public toilet, hot shower, 24 hours. More than we get at our four star. turned out to be a lot more interesting than I thought it would be. I, thanks to that, that couple inviting us in to see their old house and visit to the doctor, the 95-year-old doctor. We're done with Moshi. Our trip is almost over.